Hey guys, my name's Diffused Animal. Welcome to another video. This time we are on Villa defending Aviator and Games Room with the operators Mirror, Mute, Jaeger, Castle, and Clash. A big shout out to the Francais who left a comment in a previous video stating he wanted a strat that included Clash. This one's for you, my dude. I hope you enjoy it. So we're going to start off with Mirror and open up that dividing wall between Aviator and Study. And then you're going to make your way into Games Room and reinforce the second wall from the right hand side on the east wall then you're gonna skip a wall to your left and reinforce the another panel and then shoot out your rotation and line of sight to the side of said wall you want to make sure this is a vault rotation so you can rotate into aviator if you want to then head over back to the east side and continue your line of sight in that direction you then want to place your first mirror on the first reinforcement. Make sure you shoot out the end so you get the optimal line of sight. And place your second mirror on your north reinforcement. Again, shoot out the end so you can see more. As you can see, you want to make sure that's a vault hole again. And then your position is to play behind either mirror. Sometimes you do get... Um, blockages on mirrors um, normally they are client side it's a pain in the ass it seems to be worse this season but you want to be playing behind either one of those mirrors with mute covering study um, the south doorway of study there's also a window in there there's a balcony outside that south door and looking into games room now you want to be using your C4 if people try to plant behind the vault door, which they will try and do. But you need to practice this throw as if it goes too short like that one, then it won't have the desired effect. It won't kill the, pe the person planting behind there. And again, if you throw it too long, um, the same thing will happen. It won't kill the person who's planting. So give that throw a practice. It's pretty easy to do. Once you get used to it, you should be getting it every time. Obviously, watch out for your west door. That will be, tech, be protected by other two operators. But overall, you and Mew are the main anchors to this bomb site. Moving on to mute then, and you're going to start off by placing your first mute jammer in vault just behind the reinforced vault door. This should stop a twitch drone from getting through. Then you're going to reinforce that single panel in the vault before placing a mute jammer on the right hand side. This will stop hopefully a thermite or habana habana it and a twitch drone entering through the drone hole. You're then going to reinforce that wall in between the two mirror windows and place a mute jammer in between the two on the left and then the two on the right. This will stop anyone habanaing your mirrors. As said before, mute will then be playing with mirror in the bomb site. You don't have to take the shotgun again, as always. This is just so I can show you. The actual C4 throw and what you will be covering. So Mew will be taking the C4 as well, so you'll have two. If they get in through study, even though that door will be castled and try and plant behind the bomb, you can throw your C4 in that direction. And then here's the C4 throw where you want to be aiming it at if they try and plant behind the vault door. As you can see, that will get anyone who's there. And the beauty about this is once you've thrown that first C4, it leaves a nice hole looking down into piano. This means that Jaeger, who will be roaming, can then rotate into piano if you know that's where the push is from, especially if you've killed the guy with the diffuser. And he can then cover that, an extra cover, even though you have an extra C4, from underneath. Jaeger is the third operator on the strat then, and he's going to start off by placing a deployable shield in that west door of games room to stop a twitch drone entering there before placing his first ads 
in between those two mirror windows to protect mirror and mute. He's then going to make his way into the west corridor round to study and place an ADS in that corner. And then run into aviator room and place your third ADS in the northeast corner to stop any smokes or flashbangs coming through that door. And then, like we said before, Jaeger's role is to roam either on the north side below, wherever he feels most comfortable, and of course then rotate into piano later on in the game to cover the bomb, to cover the plant underneath or behind vault door. Castle is next up on the list then and he's going to start off in games room by reinforcing the two northwest walls. He's then going to follow Jaeger round into the west corridor to study, make sure Jaeger's there first and then castle the doorway in the northwest corner. That ADS is to stop that castle door from getting naded. You're going to follow Jaeger back into Aviator, castle the door behind him, wait until he's placed his final ADS, and then castle that doorway to the hallway in the northeast. Place your bulletproof camera on the opposite wall facing that doorway. That way you'll be able to see if anyone is planting behind that vault door. And then rotate through vault into the west corridor and this is where you will be playing. You'll be playing alongside Clash in this corridor and basically your job is to pin down the south staircase and anyone entering from the north and stop anyone from getting to that west doorway of games room um, which is protecting your two anchors i.e. mute and mirror. Last but not least is the Notorious Clash. Thank you once again to the France for suggesting this video. If you have any suggestions, uh, make sure you comment down in the comment section below on any OBJs or any operators that you want to see in a strat. So you want to make your way into games room, reinforce the two reinforce the two soft walls in the south west corner. Then head into the west corridor, place some barbed wire up towards the north side and then I like to place my second bit on the south staircase at the bottom to give you a heads up there. And like we said before, Clash's job is to play with Castle in that corridor to protect the west door to games room. That's it for this one then guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Until next time, take it easy and give them hell.